Yo, 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 what's going on, everybody? It's your boy, The Wolf, here, uh, bringing you guys another video today on Crypto Hopper. Uh, one of you guys had asked me to see my configurations and settings. Um, so that's basically what I'm going to do in this video here today. Um, as you can see, you know, a lot of reds right now, as far as my position goes. Um, we did have a nice little rally there for Bitcoin, the whole market as a whole. So I did collect some wins. Um, but again, like I said, this whole video is basically just about my configurations and my settings. So let's go ahead and click here. Sorry for the slow loading time, but so you come here. So as far as my buy settings goes, uh, this is my, my max time open buy, which is I believe is 50 minutes. Uh, right now, positions I'm doing is six, and I hold one uh, position per coin. Uh, you can change that if you want to, you know, double dip on coins and have, you know, multiple positions of the same coin. Totally up to you. Um, when it comes to coins and amounts, obviously, I'm using Bitcoin. Uh, as far as the selected coins go, um, I select these based on the signals that I'm following. And, um, you know, I do go ahead and change some of these just in case... Uh, you know they're not doing too well as far as sales goes um so you know i do come in here and play with this because you know again you do have to watch the market if you know certain coins are not doing well for you personally you know i would just advise that you would change them and that's actually what i'm thinking about doing um in the last couple of days here you know I've had some bad uh losses um but you know changing coins it's easy and then we come to strategy I'm only doing signals only again guys i'm only following signals that's all i'm doing um it makes it real easy so i follow other people's signals and you know takes out all the hard part as far as the trailing stop by i don't have this on um you can enable this if you like but again i do not have it on um sell settings i'm taking profit at two percent um as far as the max open time to sell uh, I have it at 30 minutes because um, sometimes, you know, when you're trying to sell some of your positions, you do get stuck and the order gets canceled. So uh, I used to have it at 20 minutes. Now I have it at 30 minutes and I've seen a, a bigger difference when it comes to getting those sales actually completed. And then you know, again, no sell strategy here. As far as stop loss goes, um, I put it at 4%. Um, that's just, you know, my personal... Um, decision on that because you know i have seen coins you know drop where you get to like maybe what the low threes almost close to four and then i see it go rally back up and the next thing you know it's a profit so i keep it at four um again you know quick wins you know if i take an l here oh well it's an l you know it's part of the game but it's whatever but i have this at four and as far as the trailing stop loss i'm gonna have it at percentage of 0.25 and then it gets armed at uh, two. Um, so, you know, when it's going up, it's going up, right? But then, you know, it's kind of going down. It will still, you know, sell uh, and try to get that profit. So I'm not sure if you guys see my other videos where I do have some profit uh, with trailing stop losses. And then that's really it, guys. Um, that's that's my settings. Uh, so let's see here. Let's just go to my stats real quick. Because, again... I've been having a good month for February so far. Obviously, you know, it's been shitty the last, I would say, what, day or so. Um, just for, you know, we see a lot of red. So, as you can see, you know, daily profits were good. And then I took a dive. You know, it is what it is. But, like, again, like I was saying, as you can see, a lot of the coins I went off of are, you know, all right here. And then as soon as you go down here... Like see um, Tron, AST, Theta, Zcash, Wall and Chain. You know, my average profits for those coins aren't the greatest. Like, you know, was this Ethos? You know, I might have to change that coin to somebody else's coin. Um, as you can see, my most traded coins are over here. And then you can kind of compare this side to this to see, you know, do you really want to even still consider, um, you know, watching that coin or even trying to buy that coin just based off of what's going on as far as your most traded coins? Um, so again, I'm gonna go in here and adjust those settings. But if you again, if you come here to trade history as we are getting ready to end February, um, so we got here. Oh, it looks like I just bought some EOS. Wow, 
All right, cool. Hopefully that's your profit. You know what I'm saying? Um, so as you see, you know, these are my two stop losses for today. Today's been kind of slow, I would say, and bad. <laughs> as you can see, most of today has been L's, which, you know, it is what it is. But you come back here, there's that trillion stop loss that I had mentioned earlier. I still got profit off of it. Um, you know, I've had some better days. I would say, yeah, a lot more bear days. But again, last couple of days, or say last, yeah, last day in the half. No, just last day. Yeah, I'll say the last day's been shitty. You know, a lot of stop losses. It is what it is. Not really tripping, as you can see. Hopefully, this EOS that just got bought. You know, hopefully that turns into a profit. But again, you know, we had a big surge in the market, which is great, and. Um, for those of you that, you know, want to try these settings, by all means, you can. Um, hopefully, you know, I went slow enough for you guys to see all the settings. Uh, if you guys didn't get a chance to see them or if I went too fast, make sure you guys leave a comment down below. Um, but that's going to really wrap up this video. Like I said, one of my subs wanted to see my configuration and settings, so I made this video. Uh, if you guys like the video, make sure you guys give it a thumbs up, share with your friends. And if you guys are new to the channel, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button. And um, until next time, take care, y'all.